2020, exam one, question six, networks and decision making. Okay, so we need to work out the minimum completion time for this project. That's the critical path, just a code phrase. We've got the whole project here. Now you've got some values, so you can just try out a few paths and, and, and do some elimination uh, and try and find the values, but let's do it properly. And remember, you only need to do a forward pass to find the minimum completion time. The backward scan is to actually name that critical path. But once you get a value at the end there, that's the answer. All right, so I put my boxes. Forward scan is adding for the maximum, and it gives you the EST. So if we go zero here, zero plus four, four. Uh, zero here, zero plus seven is seven. Seven plus four is 11. Six plus four is 10. So we're gonna go with the 11. Already that tells me to go in certain directions, but let's just go with it. Seven plus eight gets me 15. Uh, 11 plus three gets me 14. 14 plus three gets me 17. So I'm gonna choose the 17. 17 plus five gets me 22. I already know the answer is E. Let's be nice and finish the diagram off. Four plus two, six. Six plus nine, 15. Uh, so 11 plus three is 14. I choose the 15. 15 plus 5 is 20. Uh, 14 plus 6 is also 20. Um, what did I say? 15, 17 plus 5 is 22. Uh, there you go. The answer was 22.